did you think about Sauce Gardner? You went up against him one-on-one, -on -one, and what did you think about what he accomplished in year one? No, I mean, I thought he did a great job in year one. Um, you know, sometimes it's hard just to be able to live up to that first-round standard because no matter how great you are, it's like, well, you're supposed to do that. You know, you're a first-rounder. But I think the way that he played, it's like the epitome of what you, what you want a first-rounder to play as. Um, the fact that he was, what, nominated as an All-Pro, the fact he was nominated as a Pro Bowler, like, everybody sees that. And that's something that's really, really rare. Like, you don't really see rookies getting a Pro Bowl night in their first year. So I um, think he, think he's doing great. And to show what he did his first year, I mean, you know, that's Hall of Fame caliber. How challenging is he for a receiver to go against? Oh, he's very challenging. You know, I didn't really get the chance to go against him as much because I, I was out a couple of them quarters. I had to get some stuff done. But um, just seeing the way that he plays, the way that he breaks on the ball, um, the way that he presses, the way that he keeps himself his face, um, you know, he's doing a lot of stuff, learning a lot of stuff real fast. And sometimes it takes people years to be able to learn and figure out. Um, I think he's in a great system that – that he's able to showcase his true ability and everything that he could do, he, he can do within his talent, and just excited to see how he continues to play. We know who you're rooting for, Offensive Rookie of the Year, Kenneth Walker. Great season with the Seahawks, but from afar, do you appreciate what Garrett Wilson accomplished in year one, and what do you like about his game? Oh yeah, I think he's a phenomenal receiver, man. Um, you know, just throughout all the stuff that happened there, like he was still able to get to a thousand yards. Um, you see, you see the spurts of how great of a receiver he can be when he has a chance to have a ball in his hands, um, catching the ball, um, whether it's getting down or whether it's just exploding after the catch and making something else happen. Um, he's really, really dynamic, and, you know, him and Olave. So, you know, it's pretty cool. They went to the same school, and, you know, they're known for bringing out some of the best receivers. Awesome. Appreciate your time.